In 1981, Prince Charles and Lady Diana announced their engagement after meeting approximately four years earlier. Despite early signs of trouble, they proceeded with their wedding, which became a grand event. Over the course of their 15-year marriage, they welcomed two children before ultimately deciding to divorce in 1996. Tragically, just a year after their separation, Princess Diana died in a car accident. However, the mysteries surrounding their relationship did not perish with her. Here's an exploration of the undisclosed aspects of Diana and Charles's marriage. While you may have seen numerous images of Charles and Diana together, there's an intriguing detail that may have escaped your notice. In 2017, sociologist Philip Cohen pointed out on Twitter that despite appearing taller than his wife in official photos and paintings, candid images revealed that Diana was actually the same height as Charles. The royal family has never addressed this peculiar camera illusion, leaving room for speculation. Perhaps Charles was sensitive about his height, or maybe there's a deeper reason behind it. While the truth remains elusive, it sheds a different light on their relationship. That balcony kiss, the first kiss as husband and wife, is always a significant moment. However, at their wedding, Prince Charles reportedly forgot to kiss his new bride after exchanging vows. To remedy the situation, they shared a kiss on the balcony of Buckingham Palace, sparking the tradition of the iconic balcony kiss later recreated by Prince William and Kate Middleton. True love. Despite the fairy tale appearance of Charles and Diana's wedding, their relationship was far from ideal. In their first joint interview post-engagement, when asked if they were in love, Charles responded ambiguously, stating, whatever in love means. This response haunted Diana for years, revealing a deeper complexity to their relationship. Odd relations. Diana shared intimate details of her marriage during a conversation with Peter Settelin. Despite being married for 12 years, she hinted at a lack of physical intimacy with Charles, describing their relationship as odd. Her revelations painted a poignant picture of the struggles within their marriage. Not-so-secret affairs. Before their wedding, Diana overheard Charles expressing his enduring love for his former girlfriend Camilla Parker Bowles. Despite this, Charles later engaged in an open affair with Parker Bowles. Diana also sought solace outside the marriage, developing close relationships with other men. Dark times. Amidst Charles's affair with Camilla, Diana sought guidance from the queen, only to receive a dismissive response. Feeling rejected and trapped in her marriage, Diana struggled with an eating disorder. She felt the blame for the marriage's failure was unjustly placed on her, leading to further emotional turmoil fears of sabotage. As distrust grew between Charles and Diana, they both harbored suspicions about each other's motives. Charles began to believe that Diana and her friend Sarah Ferguson were conspiring against him. These suspicions deepened the rift between them, contributing to the unraveling of their marriage. The Queen's final say, ultimately, the decision to end their marriage was influenced by external factors. Despite initially opting for a long-term separation, Diana received a letter from the Queen urging a formal divorce. Thus, on August 28, 1996, the tumultuous royal union officially concluded, setting the stage for Diana's untimely demise just a year later. Thanks for watching.